The food chain Pret a Manger has been fined £800,000 after a worker was left fearing for her life while stuck in one of its freezers. Westminster City Council said the employee became trapped in temperatures set at minus 18 degrees Celsius for two and a half hours while working at the Victoria Coach Station branch in July 2021. She was treated for suspected hypothermia. The company said it had carried out a full review and cooperated with the council's investigation. People are risking their lives by walking along the tracks at a South West London railway station. Network Rail says there have been several cases of people on the tracks at Motspur Park Station in New Malden after a footbridge was closed for renovations. Five incidents have been reported, including adults and children. Londoners are ditching cash faster than any other region. The number of visits to cash machines in the capital has halved since 2019, according to recent data. But with some services and shops going completely cashless, there is concern that some people could feel excluded. I think it's really useful, so I don't like carrying cash now. It makes it a whole load easier, but I just don't think it's very accessible for everybody. When you spend by card, so we don't know how much you can spend. But when you get by cash, so you know you have 50 or 20 pounds, so you can uh, adjust your budget. I love it because I never carry cash. <laughs> so for me, it's brilliant. The consultation over the closures of hundreds of railway ticket offices closes tomorrow. All three main rail unions are campaigning against the closures, warning it would particularly affect disabled and elderly passengers. The rail delivery group said it would make sure customers' views are taken into account.